This is what I've done on our January challenge. I am not done, but I'm scooting off to Arizona today. So I wanted to get this uh, in the works for you so you could see what I've done with my doodles and signs and beads and things like that on this. Very, very fun. I'll bring it in a little bit closer. I'm still going around things with my Stabilo, but I have to stop and go take a shower. Good morning, good morning. So my intention is to do a wash on some of this spiral area. Won't need very much paint. And it's just going to be a wash so that it alters the color just a little bit. So I'm diluting some acrylic paint with some water. And we'll let that dry. When that's dry, I'm going to bring a little bit of sandpaper in and just take the solid look out of there. Rough it up just a little bit. So I'm not really happy with the color of that. I'm bringing in my Everblend Art Marker by Arteza and I'm going to come in and add some color to this. The acrylic for me is too opaque, so I'm going for something that's has lots of color, but isn't so opaque looking. So we'll see what happens here. I do like the look of it better. Kind of bring it and bleed it out here. Next I'm going to bring in lavender. So I have lavender up to here. I'm bringing in the ochre. Bring in some apple green. And a little bit of pumpkin. I'm going to bring in my Stabilo, go around all of these fun shapes, and low light them.
And I sent you a couple of sheets of fun designs that you can use in your spiral. So I'm going to go ahead and play with some of those images in my spiral. So this is where you just go for it. So I've got these symbols in here, and I do not like them. So this is the piece of paper that I cleaned my, oh, that's pretty too, that I cleaned my brayer on when I was doing the jelly prints. And so I'm going to see if I can cut a piece that will fit here. And I will glue that on and do a little repair. I like doodling better than I like the symbols, so we will just see what we can do around that.
Okay, so I've just been playing. I did mend this area. I like it much better. Uh, I'm going to doodle some more and play, play, play. Good morning, dark o'clock here in Vallejo, California. Coffee in hand, yoga done. I'm going to bring a needle and thread in with some little beads. These I got from Julianne a long time ago. And I'm going to see if I can just add some into the spirals, which I think will be fun. I have no idea where, but we will poke some holes and go for it. I'm going to bring my awl in, poke two holes here. Slide my needle in, grab one of those gorgeous paper beads, I'm going to loop that through again just to make sure it's secure. and then knot it on the other side. I'm just going to continue to add things to the spiral. I don't know what it's going to be, but I'm going to have fun. Oh, that's nice, huh? Have fun adding things. I'm going to play around with some more doodles. All right, I have a lot more doodles on here, little signatures and signs. I'm going to go around the edge with my Stabilo again, just to darken up this edge a little bit. I'm going to go around all of my white areas with uh, the Stabilo, darken the edge of those. And then I'm going to have to call this done for now. I have to go take a shower and hop a ride to the airport. But I did want to play a little bit before I scoot it out so that I could get this to you. And this is what I've done with our challenge so far. I can't wait to see what you guys have done. So go create, go play, go have fun. And as I add to this, I will keep you posted. And ta-da!